Hello everybody. Welcome back to another session of Mathematics Made Easy. Now our topic is trigonometry. I found a question there in uh, APDSC question paper. It is cos 12 degrees plus cos 84 degrees plus cos 132 degrees plus cos 156 degrees. So we are finding the supplementary angles of 132 degrees and 156 degrees. What are supplementary angles? A pair of angles are said to be supplementary if their sum is equal to 180 degrees. So we are finding supplementary angle of 132 degrees and supplementary angle of 156 degrees. Now let us take 180 minus 132. This value is here it is 10 minus 2, 8, 7 minus 3, 4, 48 degrees. And 180 minus 156, this is a 10 minus 6, 4 here. And 7 minus 5, it is a 2, 24 degrees. So we are going to these two. Now, first term is cos 12 degrees. Plus second term is cos 84 degrees. Cos 132 degrees can be written as cos of 180 minus 48. Plus last term, cos 156 degrees can be written as cos of 180 minus 180 minus 24 which is equal to cos 156. Now cos 12 degrees plus cos 84 degrees and this is third term is cos of 180 minus theta. Cos of 180 minus theta is equal to minus cos theta. So use that rule it becomes minus cos 48 degrees and this is cos of 180 minus theta minus cos theta is here 24 degrees. So finally our expression is cos 12 degrees plus cos 84 degrees minus cos 48 degrees minus cos 24 degrees. Now let us take the terms cos 12 degrees minus cos 48 degrees. These two terms we are choosing. Similarly, plus cos 84 degrees minus cos 24 degrees. Apply cos C minus cos D formula for first two terms. Similarly, for third and fourth terms also, we are going to apply cos C minus cos D. So, cos C minus cos D equal to minus 2 sin C plus D by 2 sin C minus D by 2. Apply that same formula here. Minus 2 sin C plus D by 2. 12 plus 48 by 2 sin C minus D by 2. C is a 12 minus D is a 48 by 2. Plus similarly here also we are going to apply that the same formula. Minus 2 sin 84 plus 24 by 2 sin 84 minus 24 by 2. Then this becomes minus 2 sin 12 plus 48 it is a 60 by 2 sin 12 minus 48 it becomes 8 minus 2 here it is 6 and this is a 4 minus 1 it is 36 minus 36 by 2 plus and this is a minus 2 sin 84 plus 24 it is 108 by 2 sin 84 minus 24 it is 60 by 2. Then, this uh, minus 2 sin 60 by 2 is nothing but 30 degrees into sin of minus 36 by 2, it is minus 18 degrees plus, plus of minus it becomes minus 2 sin 108 degrees by 2, it becomes 54 degrees sin 60 by 2 which is equal to sin 30 degrees then minus 2 into sin 30 degrees value is 1 by 2 sin of minus theta sin of minus theta is minus sin theta so this becomes minus sin 18 degrees minus 2 sin 54 degrees into sin 30 degrees is 1 by 2 we can cancel 2 in numerator and denominator similarly in first term also we can cancel in numerator and denominator. Finally, we have minus, minus of minus is a plus sign 18 degrees and this is a minus sign 54 degrees. We know that sign 18 degrees is equal to root 5 minus 1 by 4 and sign 54 degrees equal to 
root 5 plus 1 by 4. So let us use the values. Root 5 minus 1 by 4 is a first term minus second term root 5 plus 1 by 4. So denominators are same. Directly we can simplify numerators here. Open the bracket. It becomes root 5 minus 1 minus root 5. Minus of plus 1 is a minus 1. Now we can cancel positive root 5 with negative root 5. And this is a minus 1 plus minus 1 is a minus 2. By denominator is a 4 which is equal to minus 1 by 2. Thank you.